enter this month's PSN, Xbox, and a Steam gift card giveaway. All you guys gotta do is make sure you drop a like on the video, comment some down below, and also make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Good luck to everybody, and hope you guys will enjoy the video. What is going on, you guys? This is Cindy here, and today what I got for you guys is a video showing you guys how to get the M27 in Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Now, if you guys don't remember, the M27 was actually a thing like six months ago in Black Ops 3 where you could unlock it in multiplayer, but they actually patched it. And this is actually a brand new method. No one's actually uploaded a video about this. So this is your first video that you're going to be watching about this. And I'm going to show you guys the brand new method of actually how to unlock the M27 in Black Ops 3 multiplayer. As you guys can see, I actually have it on my second account. And you know, this is all legit. And by the time that you guys, you know, leave this video, you should be able to then unlock the M27 for yourself. So the first thing that I want to run by you guys is number one, make sure you have one other player to do this with you. And number two, before you go into custom games, make sure that you create a class that has a melee weapon and just a melee weapon under the create a class. So make sure you have those two steps completed before actually, you know, starting this and you know, all that stuff. So let's get straight into the tutorial. So the first thing that you guys want to do is go into custom games. Now, once you're under custom games, all you have to make sure you're doing is make sure you're under a competitive game mode, such as TDM, domination, it doesn't matter. Okay. So once you do that, go under edit game rules. Now, once you do that, you go down to the competitive side of it and enable the band slash protecting voting and also make sure you have four minutes under the band slash protective time or protect time and make sure you have four minutes under create a class edit time so as you see i'm going to do four minutes for the both of them and once you do that then click start you're ready to go and you know just start the game now this is where the second player comes in you know handy so make sure you have the second player and you know i'll get right into it and i'll explain some more all right so now that you did all the settings you guys and now you're going to see this menu right here where it says you know ban or protect each weapon it doesn't even matter you can click the vmp you can click any weapon of your choice so i'll just click the hg40 and you have to make sure that you ban one of these weapons now once you do that you will then get another screen that says edit create a class now once you see that you're going to want to then click x to then actually you know create or edit the create a class and this is where that melee weapon like i said before comes in handy so make sure you have a melee weapon you know already made before you actually go into the custom games so i made the mvp now you have to wait for your second player to send you an invite so make sure you're hovering over the mvp and then this is where the second player will send you the invite as you guys see death just send me the invite then you're going to want to hit want to join his game now once you join his game you're going to then kind of hear that i just joined it i just heard him join so once he once you join his game he's going to have to make sure he's in the multiplayer like multiplayer once he sends you an invite now once you join he's going to then go to campaign so it's not zombies it's campaign so make sure he you know the second player goes to campaign menu once he's in the campaign menu you're then going to want to click mvp so just or just whatever melee weapon of your choice so click x and then go over to the launcher side of things and you will then see the war machine under the launchers now once you hover over it do not click it just hover over it he will then have to go back into multiplayer now once he goes back to multiplayer then that is where you guys can then click x over the war machine so i believe he's in multiplayer right now so that is where then you click x and this is where then you guys have to make sure you do this or you will lose the m27 instantly make sure you click oh 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 three times because that's how you actually like save it to your creative class and once you do that make sure then he kicks you from the party so as you see he just kicked me from the party and go under your creative class and make sure you do these steps okay so number one make sure that you copy this class okay so copy it and then put it under your second class okay so your second class you know so the custom one is my second class so make sure you copy it and then paste it under your second class which you guys see i just copied it and pasted it under the second class and then what you guys have to do is make sure that you restore the first custom class to the default class setup so reset to default and then once you see that go under custom one and then you guys will then see the heat wave is still there okay so all you guys then want to do is just you know just exit everything else out and you guys will see the m27 has been unlocked on your account so that's the side of like the first player now i kind of want to show you guys what it looks like from the other perspective just so you guys can both see kind of like what it, what it looks like from each side of things what i would recommend you guys do is just get one other friend and you guys can both do this pretty quick like it literally will take you guys four minutes each or something like that so 
like I said, you guys, drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. If you guys want more glitch videos and stuff like that, definitely let me know. Also, I want to do this in this video as well. If this video can hit 2,000 likes, I'm going to give away a $20 PSN card or even an Xbox card. So if you're on Xbox, comment your gamer tag. And also, if you're on PSN, comment down your gamer tag. And also, comment down your gamer tag to help other people out. Because I know there's going to be a lot of people in the comments like, hey, I don't have friends. Can you please help me? So, you know, I want you guys to comment your gamer tags. And you guys should just help each other down in the comments and stuff. Just so you guys can get some friends and all that stuff. So, now that we just did this, I want to show you guys what it looks like from a second player perspective. So let's get right into that. All right, so now that he's in your party, you're going to then want to take him to the campaign menu. Now, once you take him to the campaign menu, you're going to then want to make sure that you stay in the campaign menu up until he's then hovering over the war machine under the campaign. So I'll give him, you know, maybe five seconds, seven seconds, something like that. And once he's then doing that, you can take him back to the multiplayer menu. And then you can obviously, you know, kick him from the party which i'll just get right into so now he's hovering over the war machine i want to then now take him back to multiplayer so go back to the multiplayer menu which i just was in go back to the multiplayer menu and now this is where he then has to click oh 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 three times and then once he's completed that task you can then kick him from the party because that's kind of how you save this to your creative class like you have to click oh 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 to create like you know save it but then you also have to make sure you kick them from your party to like save it to your class so now that you kick him from your party Party, he should now be able to have the you know the m27 under his class setup so depth do you now have the m27 under your class yep i do all right so me and depth got the m27 that fast you guys me and him both got it within you know seven minutes something like that so you and your friends can now do this and now i actually quickly want to show you guys what it actually looks like in multiplayer just for those people that aren't actually going to do this you know you're not going to get in trouble for this you guys you're not going to get banned the worst comes the worst you're going to get it you know taken from your creative class and that's pretty much all it is you know you're not going to get banned for this so don't think you're going to get in trouble for this also like i said before you guys i really want you guys to comment your gamer tags down below this works on xbox and also playstation 4 so make sure that you guys are helping each other out comment down your gamer tags below respond to other people help each other out you guys all right help each other out because i know there's people out there watching this video that don't really have too many friends on playstation that would actually be willing to do this or even xbox so comment your xbox gamer tags down below and also your playstation gamer tags and hopefully you guys can win this 20 dollars psn card or even xbox card at 2000 likes you guys so if you guys could smash it for me i would appreciate it and now let's get into the game just to show you guys what it actually looks like in game so now that you joined a game it should show you guys this heat wave and then it's gonna just show you kind of like a white box so you're obviously gonna want to just click that and boom as you guys can see the m27 in black ops 3 now like i said before you can't actually shoot this weapon which is a little unfortunate and if you do press r2 it takes it actually away from you and it will just switch to your fist so it's just kind of cool to like run in the game with it and just kind of see what it looks like in black ops 3 you can't even knife either like you even when i try to knife somebody you can't actually even knife someone with this weapon so it's just more look more for like the looks and everything just because obviously like you know it's the m27 it actually shows like if you look at it in theater mode it actually shows m27 like engraved on the side of it so if you really want to do that you can do that just to make sure that it is actually the m27 but you know i just wanted to show you guys how to do this glitch it's pretty cool obviously you know it's really really easy as long as you have one other friend and you know i wish you could shoot this weapon though if you could shoot this weapon this glitch would be like the best and like i said you guys you're not going to get in trouble for this so this is more like of a fun glitch you guys can do yesterday i uploaded the bowing knife video so if you guys want to check that out you guys can do that I'll link it down in the description below. So if you guys want to know how to get the Boeing knife in Black Ops 3 multiplayer, you guys can go check that out. So if you guys want more glitch videos and stuff, definitely let me know down in the comments. Make sure to comment your comment your gamer tags down below, and you know subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and I would appreciate that. Oh my God, look at this! I just died. Wow. I, I I've never seen this. I died, and now it looks like a Kimboed. You see that? That's actually super cool. That's actually really cool. Do you see it? It almost looks like a Kimboed. When I run. It looks like a little melee. Like, look at it. I wonder what this guy's thinking. Like, oh my god, what is this kid holding right now? But yeah, this is how you unlock the M27 in Black Ops 3 multiplayer. So hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, drop a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And check out the boy Death GFX down in the description below. He's close to a thousand subscribers. And he's just uploading a lot of glitch videos and stuff like that on his channel. And he's the dude that actually found this new glitch with the M27. So huge shout out to him. And obviously, thank you to him for actually helping with the video. Because you need one other person, which he was that one other person 
for me in this video so shout out to depth thank you for obviously helping you know to unlock the m27 in black ops 3 multiplayer and hopefully you guys can go do it for yourself with all your friends and stuff so thank you guys for watching drop a like on the video 2,000 likes now give away a you know $20 PSN card or Xbox card doesn't really matter so hope you guys did enjoy thank you guys for all watching peace out